welcome to channel don't forget to subscribe and press the bell icon tor short for the onion router is as free and open source software that enables anonymous communication it does this by directing internet traffic through a worldwide network of volunteer operated servers think of it like a labyrinth bouncing your data through multiple layers of encryption when you use tor your internet traffic is encrypted and routed through at least three randomly selected Tor relays. Each relay only knows the IP address of the relay before it and the relay after it, making it very difficult to trace the traffic back to you. This is what makes Tor so effective at protecting your anonymity. Tor Browser, a modified version of Firefox, is specifically designed to work with the Tor network. It comes pre-configured with privacy and security settings that prevent unintentional data leaks. This makes it an excellent choice for anyone looking to browse the web anonymously. Kali Linux, a Debian-based Linux distribution, is popular among security researchers and ethical hackers. It comes with a wide range of tools pre-installed, making it an excellent platform for exploring anonymity tools like Tor. Installing Tor in Kali Linux is a straightforward process. Open a terminal window and type the following command, sudo apt install tor. Once the installation is complete, you can start the tor service by running sudo system skill start tor. To check if tor is running correctly, use the following command, sudo system sale status tor. You should see a message indicating that the tor service is active and running. Congratulations, you have successfully installed tor on your Kali Linux system. While Tor does an excellent job of anonymizing your internet traffic, it doesn't change your IP address. This means that while your online activities are hidden, your ISP can still see that you're using Tor. Your internet service provider or ISP can still monitor the fact that you're connected to the Tor network, even if they can't see the specific websites you're visiting or the data you're transmitting. This is where Tornet comes in. Tornet is designed to work alongside Tor to provide an extra layer of security and anonymity. Tornet is a tool that enhances your privacy by frequently changing your IP address, making it significantly harder for anyone to track your online activities. This constant change of IP addresses adds a dynamic layer of protection. Imagine trying to follow someone who keeps changing their appearance and location. That's what Tornet does for your online presence. Imagine you're at a masquerade ball. Everyone is wearing a mask, so it's difficult to tell who is who. Tor is like the mask, hiding your identity from the outside world. But what if you also changed your outfit every few minutes? Tor is like the mask, hiding your identity from the outside world. Now, imagine that you also change your outfit every few minutes. This is what Tornet does. It makes it even harder for anyone to keep track of you. By constantly changing your IP address, Tornet ensures that your online activities remain private. This is what Tornet does. It makes it even harder for anyone to keep track of you. Tornet utilizes a peer-to-peer -peer network to route traffic, making it decentralized and difficult to shut down. This decentralized approach means that there is no single point of failure, making it resilient against attempts to block or censor it, making it decentralized and difficult to shut down. This makes it a powerful tool for anyone looking to enhance their online anonymity. This makes it a powerful tool for anyone looking to enhance their online anonymity. Whether you're a journalist, activist, or just someone who values privacy, Tornet offers an additional layer of protection. Section 5 Installing Tornet in Kali Linux Installing Tornet in Kali Linux is a relatively simple process. First, ensure that you have PIP, a package installer for Python, installed on your system. If not, you can install it using the following command sudo apt install python3 pip. Once pip is installed, you can install Tornet using the following command sudo pip install Tornet. This command will download and install Tornet and its dependencies. After the installation is complete, you can move on to configuring Firefox to work with Tornet. Section 6. Configuring Firefox for Tornet To use Tornet effectively, you need to configure Firefox to route its traffic through the Tor network. This can be done through Firefox's network settings. Open Firefox and navigate to Preferences. Then, go to Network Settings and select Manual Proxy Configuration. In the SOX Host field, 
enter 127.0.0.1 and set the port to 9050. Make sure to check the box that says Proxy DNS when using SOX v5. Click OK to save your changes. Firefox is now configured to use Tor as a proxy, routing all your internet traffic through the Tor network. This ensures that your browsing activity remains anonymous and untraceable. Section 7. Verifying Tornet's functionality. To ensure that Tornet is working correctly, you can run it with a specific interval for IP address changes. For instance, to change your IP address every three seconds, open a terminal window and run the following command. This command will start Tornet and instruct it to change your IP address every three seconds. The tal or count zero argument tells Tornet to change the IP address indefinitely. To verify that your IP address is changing, visit a website that displays your IP address. You should see your IP address change every three seconds, indicating that Tornet is functioning as expected. Section 8. Limitations and considerations. While Tor and Tornet are powerful tools for enhancing online anonymity, they are not without their limitations. These tools can significantly improve your privacy, but they come with certain caveats that users must be aware of to use them effectively. It's crucial to be aware of these limitations and use these tools responsibly. Misunderstanding or ignoring these limitations can lead to a false sense of security, which can be dangerous. One significant limitation is that logging into websites or services using your real credentials can compromise your anonymity. This is because your real identity gets linked to your online activity, defeating the purpose of using Tor or Tornet. Additionally, downloading files, especially large ones, can sometimes reveal your real IP address. This is particularly true if the files are not downloaded through the Tor network, which can expose your actual location. Remember that Tor and Tornet are not foolproof solutions. They are susceptible to certain types of attacks and vulnerabilities, and relying solely on them for complete anonymity is not advisable. They are tools that can help enhance your privacy and security, but they are not a guarantee of absolute anonymity. It's essential to use additional security measures such as VPNs and encrypted communications to bolster your online safety. Always be mindful of the information you share online and the websites you visit, even when using these tools. Being cautious and aware of your digital footprint can go a long way in protecting your privacy. Use Tor and Tornet ethically and responsibly. These tools are designed to provide privacy and security, but they should not be used to engage in harmful or illegal activities. Do not engage in illegal activities or access content that is prohibited in your jurisdiction. Misuse of these tools can lead to serious legal consequences and undermine the integrity of the network. These tools are meant to empower individuals, not to facilitate harmful actions. By using them responsibly, you contribute to a safer and more secure internet for everyone. Section 9 Conclusion Embrace Anonymity responsibly. In an increasingly interconnected world, online anonymity is paramount. Tor and Tornet offer powerful tools for reclaiming your privacy and safeguarding your digital footprint. By understanding how to use these tools effectively, you can browse the web with greater confidence and peace of mind. Remember to use these tools responsibly and ethically. Be aware of their limitations and use them to promote a more private and secure online experience for yourself and others. Embrace anonymity not for secrecy, but for freedom, privacy and security in the digital age.